Hey guys, so if you're watching this, you're probably wondering how to get rid of wasps and yellow jackets and all of those nasty stinging insects, right? Well, a while back I put up hummingbird feeders and that's when I started having this problem of yellow jackets specifically. A few wasps, but mostly yellow jackets, were invading my hummingbird feeders and they were actually keeping the hummingbirds from being able to feed. Well, we're going into fall now and the hummingbird feeders have come down, the hummingbirds have migrated south. but. Over the last few months, I found a really great product on Amazon that would trap and kill the yellow jackets, the wasps, and even a lot of flies were getting trapped in these. So in my description down below, there is a Amazon affiliate link. If you wanted to purchase this product, there's the link for that. And just letting you know, this is an affiliate link. So I will get a small referral fee, a little bit of compensation if you happen to use my link. But the purpose of my video is to show you this great product. Now that I've tested it for a few months, it works really, really well. And this is it right here. And these come in a two pack on Amazon for a really good, reasonable price. And this is what we're talking about here. It's a little plastic container. They seem to be well made, very sturdy. I actually dropped one of these on the concrete patio and no issues at all. Put it right back together. The top will screw off. And if you look, do you see? all of these nasty dead bugs in there. So here's what I do. I put apple juice inside of this, and that seems to be the magic solution right there. These things love the smell of apple juice. And what do they do? They fly into these little holes right here, and they can't get out. And there's even a little light inside, which I don't even know that I've even turned that on. It, it's solar, there's a solar panel on top, which powers that. And uh, it's a little light to, I guess sort of attract the bugs at night, but I haven't really thought too much about that part of it. But anyways, I'm gonna go ahead and just unscrew this right here and show you how it works. See, there you go. There's a little switch in there that turns on this light um, and it's actually turned off right now. And uh, it, it, I think it only comes on at night. So, but you can see this thing is loaded up and it only takes a few days and you'll be catching these things like crazy. But apple juice. Surprisingly, apple juice is what you need to put in there. In fact, there's actually some live gnats flying around this thing right now. When I took the lid off, I saw them in there. So there you go. And even though this thing is full of dead bugs, it does not seem to keep anything else from flying in. You know, you would think these bugs are smart enough to say, hey, you know, all my dead friends are in there. But nope, they go right on in there too. And uh, it catches all of them. So I've actually put two of these things up. Um, I've got a couple of them hanging up in the yard here, and what this has done is keep the yellow jackets and wasps, they're going after this instead of the nectar in the hummingbird feeder. So you're kind of doing a couple of good things here. You're getting rid of these yellow jackets that nobody wants, and at the same time, you're allowing the hummingbirds to feed from their nectar feeders and not be interrupted by the bees, so the wasps. So. Uh, Really great product. So if you're interested, check out the link in the description and I uh, hope these work for you as well as they've worked for me. And if you have any questions, feel free to let me know. I'll see you on the next one.